What up, y'all? It's your boy Chance, aka Shadow Blade from Bloodshot Records. And today, like, I kind of wanted to talk about, you know, not just, you know, my music career in general, but I really wanted to, you know, touch base on how all these labels like Reborn Records and all these other labels that like to talk shit and just in general how, you know, all these people just love to try to stop my progression. You see, I've got a different sound and style than most. You know, obviously, you guys know me mostly for my dub stuff and my EDM stuff. And that's great. You know, and I appreciate that love. But I also do, you know, rock, metal, you know, alternative stuff like that as well. But these labels are out here thinking they can stop my progression just because I look different from the norm. Let me give you guys an example. Today, or last night, or whenever, I don't know when they sent it, but Reborn Records, you guys know who they are by now. They're a record label that claims to be, you know, a... They claim to not be a non-profit label when they are. They sit there and say, you know, they don't charge their artists and so that and that is the definition of a non-profit label. If you guys are not charging your artists and you're helping get out there, you're non-profit, dude. Plain and simple. Basic, basic knowledge. But within this email, they basically threaten to get their legal team involved and all this other shit. And to Reborn Records, I do say this. Go ahead and try. Now, don't get me wrong. I'm not trying to sound cocky when I say this. I'm just speaking the truth. And the truth is, uh, is that I am untouchable. And you want to know why? I've had record labels like you guys try to do the same shit. They try to get their legal teams involved and stuff like that. And guess what? They all failed. And you want to know why? It's because I can't be touched. I have nothing to lose. So to Reborn Records, I say, go ahead, get your legal team involved, do whatever the fuck you want. I don't care. At the end of the day, I'm still going to be making my music and I'm not going to give a fuck what you guys think, say, or do. And it's labels like these guys and people in general that don't want to work with me because of how I am. Because I don't take shit from anyone. And that's why a lot of people are so against me when it comes to my music. is because of the fact that I stand up for myself. I stand up for my music and a lot of people hate that. A lot of people hate that, you know, I defend my music and that I don't take shit from nobody. You know, and that's how I've always been. You know, you guys got to understand. I'm an army brat born and raised. You know, and when you're raised with that a certain mentality of you can't just sit there and take shit from anyone like that and you don't take shit from nobody you're gonna have people pissed at you and you know and I can't like I said I can't help that I have that mentality like I said I was raised an army brat you know my dad was 82nd airborne division staff sergeant United States army so you know I was raised around that you know I don't take shit from nobody attitude And that's how it's got to, that's how it is in the music industry. You got to, you know, not take shit from labels. And when it comes to arguing with them, you got to stand your ground no matter what. And that's how I've always been. And that's what got me to the point that I'm at now, 
with some very amazing people that I've got backing me up. Granted, I have even more that are against me because of it, but at the end of the day, I don't care. Like I said, at the end of the day, I'm still a musician. I'm still a music artist. And I'm still going to continue to do my music my way and how I want me to do it. How the people love me to do my music, I'm going to continue to do it in that way. And no one and nothing is going to stop me. So like I said, the Reborn Records and any label out there in general that wants to try to bash on me or try to tear me down, I say go ahead and try it. You will fail. I've had hundreds and hundreds of labels and people trying to stop me before. And guess what? They all failed. Every last one of them. And so you guys are going to be no different. If you want to try to stop me and be against me, go right ahead. You guys really think that I'm touchable? You're wrong. I am the one person that is untouchable. And you want to know why? Because I fear no one. I bow down to no one. I answer to no one. And let's face it, I've got nothing to lose. Which makes me very dangerous in the music scene. It makes me very dangerous. And see, and that's the problem with motherfuckers like you guys. Like Reborn Records and all you other labels out there that want to talk shit about me. You guys think you're hot shit. But we all know you're not. Like, you guys just love to talk crap, and that's all it is. It's a bunch of crap. As I said, you guys want to sit there and give me warnings about, you know, getting legal teams involved in this and that. I say bring it on. Because guess what? At the end of the day, your legal teams, they can't do shit because I've got nothing. You can't sue me for anything. You can't get me on anything. And let's just face it, if you guys took this shit to court, they would literally laugh in your face. Plain and simple, because I've got nothing to lose. Now, I can understand if I was a major artist, you know, if I was like, you know, super mainstream famous, then yeah, I might have something to lose. But let's face it, I'm not mainstream, I'm underground. And I will always remain underground. I would rather be underground than mainstream any day of the week. Straight up. I would rather rock the underground music scene for my fellow undergrounders and my friends and my family than to join a shitty ass two-faced label like Reborn Records. Hold on, hold on. Sorry, I think I dropped the cap to my iced coffee, which you guys just see me sipping on. But, you know, I'm sick to death and he's tired of, like, you know, I'm sick and tired of all these labels and all these people in general thinking they could fucking stop me. But the truth is, I can't be stopped. And I won't be screwed over and I won't be brought down. Because as I said, as far as the underground music scene goes, I'm untouchable. So go ahead, get whoever you want to get involved. Do whatever you want. At the end of the day, I don't care. At the end of the day, I'm still going to be making my music my way and doing what the fans love to see me do. Because for me, that's what it's about. It's not about being huge famous superstar i'm not trying to be a fucking superstar all right i'm trying to be a voice for the underground i'm trying to be a voice for people like me that are special needs that don't have anyone to turn to i'm proud to say that i am the voice for the special needs community i'm damn proud to say that and like i said For me, Bloodshot Records and Kill a Clown Sounds, 
is where it's at. So to any label out there that does want me, either you sign me as a professional music artist, you know, you accept me for my vocals and my music and everything in general that I do. Otherwise, you get the fuck on and find someone else. Because at the end of the day, I'm going to be doing my music my way and i'm gonna be doing what all my fans love me to do which is my music in my style and my way and i don't care what anyone thinks if you don't like what i do you guys know where the block button is you guys know where the unfriend button is i ain't gotta show you so i guess said to anybody out there that thinks they can stop me go ahead and try Go ahead and try it, because like I said, you guys can't get me on anything. Because as I said, I fear, I literally fear no one. I don't bow down to anyone. And quite frankly, I've got nothing to lose. So go ahead and get whoever you want to get involved. Because at the end of the day, I'm still going to be here doing my music my way. And that's just a, that's just plain fucking facts. So to every artist out there in the underground, man, I say what's up to you guys. I love you guys. You guys are fucking amazing. Love every last one of you. And, you know, and to all my fans out there, much love. Love every last one of you guys. You guys are fucking amazing. Shout out to the Alien Nation. Shout out to the SB Army, man. I love you guys. But uh, also on a side note, I am releasing a brand new album very soon called Shadowborn. It's my first ever rock and metal slash pop rock album. I'm super excited for it. It's going to be new metal, heavy metal, alternative Rock, pop rock, you guys name it. It'll more than likely have it. So be ready for that. It's dropping very soon on my official Shadow Blade website. So be ready for that. That's going to be dope. Can't wait for that. But uh, with that being said, guys, I love you all. You guys are amazing. Love every last one of my fans. All my supporters. Love y'all. You guys fucking rock. I can't wait to drop that album for you guys. But with that being said, y'all, I'm about to hop off here, get into some pro drifting on Forza Horizon 4, you know, kicking with some of the pros like Slap Train and, you know, some of the others on there that I've actually gotten the chance to kick it with. So I will catch you guys later on. And also, like I said, be ready for that album dropping very, very soon, guys. Love y'all, man. Peace. Stay rocking. Stay up. And never stop working for what you want, man.